Hi guys. Medium is one of the most popular blogging platforms available out there. The platform is being heavily used by bloggers and writers all around the globe. Although Medium has a lot of daily active users, it's not great for creating your personal brand and earning money. Not to mention linking your Medium account to your custom domain is a time-consuming process. Migrating your Medium content to other platforms is a hassle too. However, if you're looking for other platforms, we have you covered. I have handpicked platforms for publishing your content free of cost and sites where you can get paid for writing articles. Watch on to learn more about these providers and find out which one will work best for your needs. And thank you for using the links in the description. So, let's get started. The first one on the list is Substack. Substack is another cool website that pays you for publishing content online. Essentially, this medium alternative allows writers to build an email list, create a newsletter, and direct readers to their website with subscriber-only content. However, unlike other platforms, you don't get paid if you get views on your content. Instead, the website runs on a subscription-based model. As a result, you'll only get paid if readers have subscribed to your content. However, as a publisher, you'll get lots of tools to help you make your content stand out. Also, you can easily add paid subscriptions without any tech skills. All you have to do is connect your bank account and set a price. The best part is that you can choose which content to monetize and which is a free article to read. The good news is Substack is free to get started and open to anyone. You don't need to be a professional writer to start your newsletter. Once you decide to monetize it, you pay 10% of your revenue to Substack. It's also worth being aware that all Substack payments are processed through Stripe, which will take an additional 2.9% plus 30 cents per transaction. However, a drawback of Substack is that you need to build your community as a publisher. Luckily, the platform has many readers, which will help you get paid, subscribers. Just make sure your content stands out. Ultimately, as a content creator, it never hurts to be involved with multiple platforms to reach a wider audience. In that respect, Substack isn't only a great alternative to Medium, but can also be quite complementary to your blogging efforts. You can absolutely put up blog posts on Medium and also use Substack to push out a newsletter. This way, you gain a higher chance of diversifying your income and increasing overall revenue from your writing. The next one is WordPress. If you're looking for a free-to-use Medium alternative, try out WordPress.com. The platform is being used by website builders, bloggers and businesses. The best part of WordPress is that it allows you to create a website where you can publish your content or use the website for your business needs. Along with that, WordPress comes with lots of free themes to choose from. So setting up a website on WordPress is an extremely straightforward job. Just install your favorite theme and you're good to go. While WordPress offers you most of the features free of cost, if you wish to enjoy advanced features for your website or blog, you must buy their premium plans. Also with the free version, you'll get the wordpress.com extension it means your website or blog address will look like your website.wordpress.com, which is unprofessional. Moreover, unlike Medium, there's no pay-to-write program for WordPress. As a result, even if you post your articles and get views, you won't get paid by WordPress. But suppose you switch to the premium version of WordPress. Using software like WordPress opens you up to a whole new range of monetization opportunities. Next, we have Squarespace. Squarespace is also one of the top website builder platforms available out there. With this platform's help, you can make any website with just a few clicks. However, Squarespace is not a free-to-use platform. Instead, you'll need to go for monthly or yearly plans. Squarespace is best suited for people lacking technical skills and wanting to have a blog. All you need to do is to sign up on the website and create a blog or website. Also, as a premium platform, you will set up your custom domain. Plus, it has many SEO tools to help you curate your content for more traffic to your website. Just ensure you're posting the right content that people are looking for online. However, it's not cheap. If you want a website that pays you for writing online, Squarespace is not the best platform to try out. Next, we have Notion. If you consider yourself a productivity freak, you must have heard of Notion. In case you haven't, Notion is a project management and note-taking tool 
that has a wide range of use cases. One such use case is content publishing. With Notion's user-friendly editor, you can turn any Notion page into a published website in seconds. You can then use the published site as a blog, portfolio, docs, or more. There's also a rising trend among startups to use Notion websites for job listings. What I like most about publishing pages on Notion is the sheer simplicity it offers. With a couple of clicks, I can get a web link to any of my Notion pages to share with friends and peers. While it's convenient for quickly sharing pages, it's not really practical to use Notion for building a loyal readership at scale. So as you can see, Medium isn't the only app out there. There are plenty of others, even beyond what we've listed here today. Some have features similar to Medium's, others have a completely different set of features and functions. The point of this video isn't to force you to use something other than Medium, it's to consider the other options out there. For some companies, sticking with what's familiar might be worth it, but for others, switching to a new alternative with tools that better suit their needs and goals can help them to build their business presence faster. Whichever tool you choose, we'd recommend trying the free version first, risk-free, and if you like it more, you can upgrade. Other than that, it's up to you. So yeah, that's it for this video. You can check the links in the description. That helps a lot, thank you. And hopefully this video will help you out. If it did, please leave a comment and click the like button as that helps too. And goodbye for now.